Hey guys, what's up? It's Joe Ready from Ready's Rise, and I am at the Motorsports by Reeves Gathering. It's a once a month gathering of some great cars and enthusiasts, and I have something very special behind me. This is a 2018 Mercedes Benz AMG GTR. Right off the bat, you can see that this thing screams with this color. I'm not really the biggest yellow fan, but this yellow with the gold, it just really pops in the Florida sun here. And this car just has a presence that people are just drawn to it like a moth to a flame. This is the car that really is coming out of Mercedes-Benz to go up against that Porsche 911 uh, twin turbo and to bring their A game. Now remember, underneath that hood, V8 twin turbo charge, you're looking at over 700 horsepower. Let's go ahead and take a look at the front of the car here. I am a huge fan of the styling of the front grille. I love the Mercedes-Benz logo. One thing I want to point out is that if you look at the emblem up here, they actually changed the colors. This used to be blue instead of black, but I like the way that they changed that and updated it. If you look coming back out, the way that the bars are on the grill, there's our AMG. When you see AMG, that's that extra brand of performance and styling that is going to go above anything that the regular engineers at Mercedes-Benz could have came up with. Huge on the on the GTR, huge opening down here. I like the piano black front splitter that comes out from the yellow. And then, of course, you have these huge functional ducts that are feeding the radiators and the intercoolers and, and everything. Remember, these are twin turbocharged V8. Nice headlights. I love the styling. Very, very high quality done. And just the way the lines of this car flow. Let's go ahead and check out the side. Like I said, the way the car has a presence, these wheels are mind-blowing. I love the gloss black finish. These are sitting on Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2. So this is a very sticky tire to do a track day, to do an autocross event that's coming out of Michelin. And you can see that these are 275, 35 series, 19 inch. So I like the way they didn't go with a 20 inch wheel, 19 inch wheel. Look at those huge calipers there. That's bigger than my shoe. I wear a size 12. Those calipers are bigger than my shoe. And you have the carbon metallic rotors that are the size of Domino's pizzas. Crazy, crazy styling and crazy performance. Coming down the side, there's our V8 by turbo. I love how the body comes out like this. Very nicely done. Functional vent on the side. And of course, up top, we have the functional heat extractors on both sides of the hood really gives it that great look that ties it back to the styling of the 50s and 60s with Mercedes-Benz. Carbon fiber side view mirror. I'll have Russell, my camera guy, show you that. The carbon fiber on the side view mirror. And of course, no supercar like this is complete without a carbon fiber roof. Carbon fiber roof, if you're wondering, is it all show and no go? This lowers the overall weight of the car and it brings down the center of gravity. If you pan back down, I really like the lower sill panel that sticks out on the GTR. Very, very nice look. I'm telling you, this car, even though it's front engine, and even though that hood looks like it's a mile long, this thing is very proportioned, 50-50 balance. Let's check out out back. If you look out back, and it has this massive, thick carbon fiber rear wing. I don't know if Russell can show you the carbon fiber weave. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then if he drops down, you can see the GTR logo. And if Russell could really master his skills and swing around this side, check out how the bottom of the wing is going to be adjustable there. So you could actually adjust the pitch of that rear wing that is functional. I like the way that the bumper is very, very clean, but it's got some extra venting. I like the logo, the GTR logo, and then this massive, 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 Rear diffuser, rear diffuser with a central exhaust. I'm telling you, this thing, like the license plate says, unbelievable. Not only to drive around, but I would love to go to a track like Sebring or Homestead or Road Atlanta or anywhere for that matter and take this out. Because that's the purpose of this car. When you see that extra letter, that R, this thing is meant for an excellent time at a track day where you're going to show up and show up some of those other Europeans, the Italians with the Ferraris, the Lambos, and other German marks like Porsche. But anyways, at the end of the day, if these are the types of cars you like to see on Rainey's Rides, leave a comment in that comment section. If you haven't hit subscribe yet, 
What are you waiting for? This is what I'm bringing for you guys. Thank you for those who have subscribed. Thank you for watching this. If you haven't been to my website, radiesrise.com, check that out. Check out my Facebook and my Instagram. All original content all the time. I want to give a big shout out to Russell for helping me bring this AMG GTR specific for you. And like always, guys, I'll see you on the next ride.